what is this? Three years ago, from a small news... Oh, this is, this is parody. There's no way this is actually 69 News. A sickening case of vandalism turned heads and turned stomachs at a Northampton County grocery store. Police say two men made a mess in the bathroom, and it may not be the first time. WFMZ's Will Lewis joins us from the Colonial Regional Police Department. This is more. fake. Well, There's no way this is real. And Robin, Wendy, some officers. This is like an Colonial Onion News Regional knockoff. There is no way 69 News is reporting on the poop bandits. And There's no way this is real. Believe they know who committed the crime, but so far, yeah, the, the 4chan poop bandit green text. With authorities. Recall the 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 yeah, you would get so much pussy if you're the PD with the Colonial Regional Police Department are looking for suspect number one and two. They called us uh, and reported that uh, somebody had spread feces around the bathrooms at the Wegmans in Lower Nazareth. The incident took place on June 30th after 2 a.m. After an Wait. employee... Wait, you can't fake a police officer uniform like that. This... Is this real? There's no way this is real right now. There is no way. Hold on. Wait, this is like a normal news station. This isn't even like The Onion. Okay, hold on. This is the main focus now. What is going on? at the Wegmans and Lower Nazareth. The incident took place on June 30th after 2 a.m. after an employee cleaned the bathroom. Police say the men stayed in the bathroom for 25 minutes. I wasn't there myself, but it was rather, uh, I guess, disgusting. Feces on the walls, floors, and ceiling, according to police. Investigators ID'd Michael Bauman and Zachary Anthony. They reviewed the surveillance. Okay, hold on. This guy... I think this is Seth Rogen. Like. Yeah. Zachary Anthony. They reviewed the surveillance video from the store, and it just so happened that one of the employees at the store recognized the two people that had gone in um, from school. The loss prevention officer told investigators loss that prevention two other officer. stores in the immediate area had the same type of incident happen to them. The problem, they didn't report it to police, but a possible fourth location did. We were informed by Northampton PD um, that they had a similar incident at the Redners over in Northampton, and we provided them with some information. What is happening? Investigating their incident. There's Please no way this is real. With either Anthony or Bauman, we reached out to both via social media. Michael Bauman responded, quote, as the great Shaggy once said, it wasn't me. Seriously, end quote. When we asked why not go to police and clear your name, Bauman replied, quote, I'll be contacting them soon. Now, both men have been charged with disorderly conduct and criminal mischief, and Wegmans is seeking restitution in the case. Now, police have sent a summons to both men, which requires them to appear in court to answer charges. If they don't appear at that court date, a warrant for their arrest could be issued. We're live in Hanover Township, Will Lewis, 69 News. What is, I am in disbelief. So that's a real news station. 69 News WFMZ TV. 69 News. This is real. This is Layla Value, Berks County, Philadelphia regions. 69 News reporting on the fucking poop bandits. This is something that's like a bit much for the fucking onion. Like, I, the reason I'm not giving, like, a crazy reaction right now, like, I didn't speak, I was, I was literally speechless. I am being handed content on a golden spoon, and I am being overwhelmed by how much nutrition is in it. Go fuck yourself. There's, this isn't real. There, if, I think there's a god. There's, there's gotta be a god. Uh... Yeah, th no, yeah, we gotta be in, like, a coma. Like, we're in a fucking... We are in a simulation, and then this is somehow a real thing. Because I would kind of get it. Right? I would kind of get it if it was just poop bandits. And that's, like, it's not even like I'm calling them the poop bandits. The fucking news themselves call them poop bandits strike again. And then it's also, it only has 4,000 views, and it's been out for, like, almost four years now. God is a memer, dude. God has, like, an iFunny page. <laughs> 